here's a harsh truth for Shopify store owners and managers. If you are not regularly A-B testing your store, then you're losing money. If you're spending a lot of time and energy sending traffic through email funnels, social media ads, influencer partnerships, or search ads, and you're not seeing consistent results, then you're probably missing out on one of the the biggest opportunities for e-commerce brands. I'm talking about conversion rate optimization with A-B testing. So what is A-B testing and how can it help you? Well, stick around because I'm going to break it all down and show you how you can use A-B testing to increase conversions drive more sales without investing more in ads. So let's dive in. So what is A-B testing? A-B testing, also called split testing, is a way to compare two different versions of a web page, product page, or even an ad to see which one performs better. You show version A to one group of visitors and version B to another, then track which one gets more conversions, clicks, or sales. It sounds simple, right? because it is. And without A-B testing, you're basically guessing what works best for your store. But with it, you can make data-driven decisions to optimize your site for more revenue. A-B testing can help tackle a whole host of obstacles that directly affect the store's profitability, including high shopping cart abandonment rate, high customer acquisition cost, high bounce rates. Most importantly, it gives you actual data on what drives customers to click and purchase. You're taking the guesswork out of your website design choices, so you're confident your store is designed to drive sales. So what should you test? Well, here are some key elements that you can start experimenting with. Product titles, product images, call to action buttons, product descriptions, page layout. There are lots of different ways you can experiment with each of these elements and test which one drives more sales. And this is just the tip of the iceberg too. There are so many different elements to test. I included a link below to Shogun's AB test use case library, which has over 20 test ideas. But just as a reminder, you only need to start with one test. Don't get overwhelmed with all the options. Just choose one and get started. AB testing your pages in Shopify is easy with Shogun. Here's a quick walkthrough of how to set up an AB test with Shogun. In the Shogun AB testing app, select create a test in the corner. You have your option between page test, template test, and theme test. We're going to test a page. From here, you can set up your test, including choosing the traffic split that you want to see your original or your variant, choosing your test goal, so we'll click through rates, and then also choosing what audience you want to see this test. So in this example, we're gonna only show the test to people visiting on their desktop. Then we're gonna choose a page and set up our test. We're going to copy original so we can make a couple of changes to the existing page that we've already created. Shogun's AB testing app is native to Shopify 2.0, so we're able to edit our page using the Shopify 2.0 editor. And all I'm going to do is move up the collection page higher on the page to see if that increases click-throughs to our product pages. I'll click save in the corner. And with the variant ready, I'm just going to review my test. We'll hit start test. Our A-B test is live and now's the hard part, waiting to see which page wins. And you can monitor that through Shogun's easy to manage dashboard right here. Every test is going to give you more data so that you can build better pages for your site. That's why you have to keep testing and refining. Small changes over time will add up to big results. And every test strengthens the foundation of your store. So when you have an upcoming sale or a product launch, or you can put more money in your ad campaigns, you can be confident that you're sending traffic to a highly optimized site. And that is how you supercharge your Shopify store with A-B testing. If you like this video, please give it a like. You can subscribe below for more e-commerce optimization tips and leave me a comment let me know what you're going to test first. Mm -hmm.